welcome to Caldwell Fitness and, and today we're going to be making like a healthier version of fried rice. So the ingredients you're going to need are of course some already uh, pre-cooked rice the day before, some frozen uh, peas and carrots, two eggs but you go use one egg yolk, one egg white, of course some, uh, I'm using grilled chicken but you can use um, any kind of uh, meat you want but I'm using this already uh, fully cooked chicken. I just got warming up in the pan. I'm going to be using some green onion. And then to my seasonings, I'm going to be using this on the chicken. Some uh, Mrs. Dash Table Blend Roasted Garlic with Herbs. A little bit of that Bayou Magic, boy. Of course, my go-to, my onion powder. Some um, black pepper. Some light soy sauce. Some dark soy sauce honey and to cook the eggs and the chicken we're going to be using this butter flavor cooking spray zero calorie everything and then to cook the whole uh, rice we're going we're gonna to use a little bit of this Mediterranean, Mediterranean blended oil and canola oil extra virgin olive oil so I'm going to cut to the next clip I'm going to prep all this stuff and cut to the next clip and I'll be back with you guys alright now we're back we got everything prepped we got the green onion cut you got the vegetables cooking. How I cook these, I just put a little bit of water on them and put them in the microwave for about two minutes and then strain them because you want them like, you want them warm but not too warm because you want to keep the firmness. And then now I have the chicken cooking here. You have the chicken cooking right there. I, I used a little bit of this butter flavored non stick spray. And then I use these chicken, I mean, I use these um, kitchen sears just to cut them up in the cubes or. You can just tear them with your hands, but I use these to cut them up in smaller cubes because they came in strips. And then I'm just I'm prepping the egg right now. The egg is pretty much done. I just yeah, the egg is done. Yeah, the egg is pretty much done. So we just go cut that out. And I will. Oh yeah, hold on, wait. Then I'm gonna um. Okay, the egg is done. I'm gonna season the chicken real quick, lightly. I'm gonna season it lightly. I'm gonna season the chicken lightly with a little bit of this, which is there. I'm not sure if I'm gonna season it lightly. Just lightly. And I'm gonna put a little bit of soy sauce, just a little bit. This is chicken breast. Chicken breast. Tyson brand, you know, already already uh, pre-cooked chicken breast. I'm just warming it up. I'm just warming it up on a stove. You can use the microwave, but I'm warming it up on the stove. I like cooking my food on the stove. I don't really trust the microwave. Alright, so once this chicken's done, I'm going to show you how to put together the rice. Right, now we back. I got my wok. You don't, if you don't have a wok, you can just use a regular pan. But I'm gonna add like a tablespoon and a half of oil to this wok. I need like a tablespoon and a half of oil. Then you know you set that to the side. You know you just move it around, move it around, move it around the wok. You know how we do it in this giant. All right, that's good right there. Uh, look in that yank. So then, I'm gonna grab my rice. But before I put my rice in there, I gotta wet my hand a little bit and move it around so it can break up. So let me do that real quick. I'm gonna do this just so it can break up. Probably a little bit more water. So hold on, a little bit more water. Just so it can break up. Just so it can break up. You gotta do this at like high. Uh, high temperature because you know the rice go cook fast you got to keep everything moving so you got to make sure it's broken up correctly you know so you know a little bit more one more time and we all right one more time and we all right all right now let me see back up a little bit the walk is hot yeah it's not even gonna throw everything up in that joint so First, we go start off with the. I'll start off with the rice. Whoa, yes! Gotta be careful next night. 
Be careful. It's hot. Be careful, because then you know we're going to keep everything moving, though. It's hot. Luckily, we didn't get burned, right? It's hot. So first, you know, you just want to... First, you know, you just want to break up this rice. I think I had a little too hot. This is my first time using it. Thing get pretty hot fast, but I won't make that mistake again. So first, you know, you want to get this rice moving around. Real nice. Keep this nice, keep this rice. Once you get it all broken up, hold on. I got to get these cubes broken up, so... We don't want no clumps in the rice. You gotta cook everything at high temperature. Everything at high temperature. So we go get this rice. All right. Get all these clumps out. That was crazy. <laughs> Shit. It's a brand new walk. My girl bought it for me for um, Valentine's Day. Thank you, baby. I love you. Alright, now the rice is pretty much trying to, trying to uh, no, I'm going to break it up a little bit more. Now we're going to add the, the vegetables. Add the vegetables. And you know, just mix all the man very well. Vegetables. You don't have to follow my steps, but this is kind of the best way to do it if you ask me personally. So, just leave it on here. Leave it on here. Then after that, we're going to add the chicken. Add the chicken. Alright. Keep the rice moving. Keep the rice moving. So we got to keep this rice moving. This walk is beautiful, man. It cooks this stuff wonderfully. I'm so glad she got this for me. I think I'm gonna have this with some fish. Cause you know, there ain't much protein here for me. So I'm gonna have it with some fish. You know. And then after that, now you wanna add your sauces and stuff. You know what, now you wanna add your egg first. I'm gonna add my egg. Egg is in there. Keep the rice moving. Mix that egg up in there. Okay, now I'm just about ready to add my uh my sauces. So first I'm start with some light soy sauce. Some light soy sauce. Then I'm gonna mix it up. Give me a little bit of color. Okay. Then you know after I get my color. I'm going to add my dark soy sauce. 99 cent store dark soy sauce. You don't have to get a 99 cent store. Add a little bit of that to see what the color looks like. Let's mix it up. Let's mix it up. Let's mix it up in this yank. In this yank. In this yank. Look at all that, boy. Mix this up real well. Real well. Let me mix it up real well. I want that full color. That full color. That's that full color. That's that full color. So let me mix it up real well. I might add a little bit more. That's that full color. Yeah, I'm probably going to add a little bit more. Oh, hold on. Let me see. I probably don't. Yeah, just a little bit more. Just a little tad bit more. Love that bit. Okay, that should be good enough. You want to keep on moving it around. Full color. And then now we go add the green onion in this giant. Add that green onion. Keep on moving it around. Keep on moving it around. Keep on moving it around. You got to keep this rice moving. Hopefully I'm not talking too much, but I'm just gotta emphasize how much you gotta keep the drag moving. Okay, you smell that? You smell it? It smells good, huh? Mm -hmm. My little sister coming, by the way. Okay, now we gonna add 
our sauce. So, first we're gonna add honey for that sweetness. Come on, honey. Add a little bit of that honey. Add a little bit of that honey. This is glazed, you know. All right. Add that honey. Oh man, now it really smells good. Cut the fire off. Fire off. Let me see. Let me see. I'm a little bit. Give it a little taste test. See a little taste test. We try to get a little bit of everything. And yank, yank this, yank. Yeah, might. Let me see. Taste and see if it need a little bit more or something. Oh yeah. Forgot about my season. Almost forgot. You gonna need a little bit of, a little bit of, a little bit of by your magic. A little bit of everything. We already got green onion in there, so we gonna use just a little bit of that. Then we go a little tiny bit of pepper. A little tiny bit. She almost got excited and ate it without the season. That's how good it is. It's good. Alright, add all that. Mix it up well. Oh my good, the fragrance. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let me see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, do me a favor. All them little Chinese menus we got up there, throw them in the trash because we don't need that no more. We got this. Man, this is delicious. You want a little taste? You want a little taste test? Let me get some chicken. Let me blow it off for you. A little bit of that. Just a little bit. How that taste? Mm, they're pretty good. Yep. There you go. And then you, that's the fried rice. You know what you're putting in this. You don't know if ain't no MSG or nothing in here, man. This is real, authentic taste of fried rice. You know what I mean? You got the egg white. You got the egg and the egg white in here. You got chicken breast instead of chicken pies. Green onions. You got your vegetables up in there. This is like your regular fried rice. Your peas, carrots. You got eggs and chicken. Green onion. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. You can't. Look at that. Look at that. Man, that is good, dude. Like, I'm. I, li I love Chinese food, so I say, man, I gotta learn how to make fried rice. I have to. Using less sodium soy sauce, a little bit of dark soy sauce, you know. You know what you're putting in here. So you don't have to go out and get no fried rice no more. You can make combination fried rice with shrimp, beef, and chicken. You know? It's simple. A lot of people think cooking is hard, man. Just research what you want to cook. You know, and if you want to make it a healthier way, use leaner meats, use less sodium, use fresher vegetables. All right, so this is Caldwell Fitness, and if you want to see more recipes like this, uh, don't forget to like my videos, subscribe, and share them. And God bless you guys. Have a good one. Bye, 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 bye. Loud.